To think about Francisco Marto, Saint Francisco Marto, is to think about a great love towards the hidden Jesus. He learned from the angel of peace, the angel of the Eucharist, this great love towards Jesus in the Blessed Sacrament, the hidden Jesus, like they used to call him. So he learned how to love, how to be by himself, alone, hidden from his sister and his cousin. And with this, with so many hours of adoration in front of the tabernacle of his parish church, San Francisco teaches us one of the most important lessons of the spiritual life. It teaches us how to make God the center of our life. It teaches us how not to be protagonists of our story, but let and allow God to be the protagonist of our story. And we, we are the instruments in his hands for his plan of love towards humanity. To think about Jacinta Marto, little Jacinto, the youngest saint in the history of the church, is to think about compassion. During the apparitions, she learned from the Blessed Mother the suffering, the suffering of the poor sinners, the suffering of the Holy Father, the suffering of the church, the suffering of the world in the midst of the war. And Jacinta thought about, I can do something about this. So she teaches us not to be indifferent, looking to all the suffering that is surrounding us, to take our responsibility. She learned from the Blessed Mother how to offer her life in prayer and sacrifices for the conversion of the poor sinners, to console the Holy Father, to help to build the peace in the world. And this is what we can learn from Jacinta Marto, not be indifferent to the suffering of the world and assume our responsibility through prayer and sacrifices in the history of salvation.